Welcome back everybody, Garage RC here. Today I got a discontinued plane. This is the UMX Ask 21 by eFlight. They do not make these anymore. I'm going to send this up with my drone and attempt to get it back in my backyard. Now if I hit one of these trees, crash into my neighbor's house, it's gone forever. So, what I'm gonna do is connect this parachute first, try to get a vibe for which way the wind's going. It's pretty calm out, we're gonna hope for the best. This is my drop unit, the DJI Mini 2. So for the UMX Ask, I don't actually need this unit, which I'm gonna show you in a minute, but for this parachute, I do. You just push the button and it opens up and let's go whatever you want. I hot glue this thing on, it's pretty sturdy. I've done this before with this. So everybody that's gonna tell me I should be towing this glider behind a plane, I did, and I'm gonna show you that here. Oh, buddy, all right, all right. Oh, you, it, it's yanking me so hard. All right. Which way are you turn, right? Turning right, turning right. Oh my God. <laughs> and even though we were successful, it did not go good. So if any of you guys got recommendation on how not to break my stuff, <laughs> greatly appreciate you. All right. All right. Oh my God. And this is why you do test flights before you put up the discontinued stuff. <laughs> Pretty calm. Wow, it's really calm. Wow. This thing's gonna land in the backyard. I'm impressed. Right on the golden? Come on. Oh, that would have been meant. Alright, <laughs> it's calm. Let's get the uh get the glider in the air. Yeah. Moment of truth here. Quick pre-flight. Alright, so theoretically, this should work. Should main work here. The DGI has GPS, so as soon as I get it to height, I should be able to put down the DJI remote, mm -hmm. pick up this remote, release the glider, fly the glider down, and then when the glider is safely on the floor, I could land the DJI. How high should we go? I don't know. You're the pilot. Oh, let's see. I'm, at, I'm not even at 100 feet yet. How high were you with the parachute? Because you want to be able to get this glider back. Actually, like, be careful because you don't want it to go in one of the trees. Right there. Twisting the drone. Oh, and we got a breeze. Alright, so we are just at 150 feet. I'm going to stop right there. Yeah, look at my camera. 150 feet, the bottom left. All right, push me a lock. In three, two, one. Oh boy. It's so sketchy with no motor. All right. Well and slow now. Are you gonna catch this again? Let's see. Come on. Oh. No. Back. <laughs> let's do that one more time. This time let's go to 200 feet. Let's bring the drone down. Oh. I've learned that normally I should stop when I'm ahead, but I just had a lot of fun doing that. So I'm gonna send it up a little bit higher this time. And uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. Push it so that the camera's facing forward. All right, let's see it up. Probably go a little faster now, right? Looks like it's doing decent. Let's see. 150, I'm blowing past. 200, let's go 250. Sketch will gash. This is 250? 256. Alright, 256. Yeah, let's check it. 256. Alright. 
I'm the truth part two. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah. Three, two, one. Oh, you're out of focus. Oh, she's gliding. Go back look. This is like so sketchy because if I screw up, I can't throttle out. I'm gonna come in hot. We got some air speed. Come over this way. Coming around. I wanna try to catch this. Oh. Come on. Oh, crash landing. <laughs> UMX S21. This is a solid unit. She's still in one piece. If you guys have one of these things, let me know. There's not too many of these left. Now, my drone's still in the air, so I got to get that. But as always, thank you for watching. I have no idea where it is.